Hey everybody, this is Gail, and I know this is not Friday, so this is not a Friday frolic, but I am just so excited, I had to uh, just make a video to tell you about it. I had to tell somebody. Um, as you know, I'm sure I mentioned probably 30 times, <laughs> yesterday was RG Presents, and it was called Project Me, and I didn't think I was going to enjoy it. Uh, to be honest, it was sort of a cutesy thing. Um, let me show you the stamp set that they were showing. And it's it's really a cute stamp set. I don't know if you can see it with the glare. Probably need to move this light, don't I? But it says, you know, it's these cute little girls. And it's in cellophane, so you probably are getting some glare. But then there's another one. And you're a sight for sore eyes. Too cute. Selfie love it. And those three adorable little girls. Well, I don't do cutesy. Or let's just say I haven't been doing cutesy. And I went ahead and signed up for the RG Presents. Mainly because it was going to allow me to see some of the things that are coming out in the July catalog. And I didn't know what he was going to show other than what we got in our kit. And um, I just I just didn't know, you know, it was going to be th that way. But um, just before RG Presents started, I went out to the mailbox and I got my very first happy birthday stamp from Fun Stamper's Journey. Every year he cre Richard creates a stamp and this one does have right down here at the bottom it's got 2017 but you know you can cut that off and use that for birthday cards. Now, isn't that adorable? I have an exclamation point that I could probably put where that 2017 is so Thank you, Richard. It came with a little card, you know, from him. So I was really happy to get that. But that's my very first one. I've been seeing everybody else's posted. So that got me excited. So then RG Present starts. And OMG, let me tell you, we had more fun. I am so glad I did it. Sorry, I'm just trying to get my cord out of the way. It's kind of in a place it isn't usually. And I don't know why. Well, I do know why because I moved it. But um, he started showing us some of the things that are coming out. And what it is, is Project Me is one of the new collections. Uh, it, I probably mentioned this before. If I didn't, it was on my Facebook party page. Every year, Richard has, I believe, four collections that go into the big catalog. And at the end of that year, they're gone. After the, you know, They go away. After the, they're only there for the year. And they had a big sale in April for 35% uh, off the uh, stamp sets and dies and, you know, little embellishments and things that went with those collections. And Project Me is going to be one of the new collections. So, of course, all I had seen was that stamp set. I'm going, okay, you know, I could, you know... I don't have to buy everything in the catalog, even though sometimes I wish I could. I had unlimited funds and could get more than I get. But then the kit came, and I started looking at my kit. When you register, and for these RG Presents uh, broadcast, you have to register. It's uh, early bird registration is $75, and then it's only good for like a week, about a week maybe 10 days, and then after that, it goes up to $99 for only a week, and then that's it. You can't do it after that. It's only open for like a two-and-a-half, three-week period. And anyway, I was afraid to, I'd miss something, so I thought, okay, I'll go ahead and sign up for this. And it was yesterday, and it was a fantastic day. But when my kit came... I hadn't even opened the paper until yesterday, but we got a 12 by 12 pack of printed paper. And I know I can show you, I'm going to wait until I turn the camera down to show you some of this. But um, we, 
we also we got of course the stamp set we got this ats which is a camera share your story and we used the camera yesterday we also got this die which is a rectangular uh film frame and these are going to be coming out um there's this one which is rectangular there's one that's square there's one that's round and there's one that's heart shaped and they're all like this with this border you know this film frame thing so that i thought was really cute and then as i was going through the cards and the things I saw some other dies that I just absolutely loved because when you order it's sort of like a bloom box you get kits for four cards and all the die cutting and stamping and everything is done well whatever is not in the stamp set is done for you and packaged excuse me so um, I have my cards um, this is part of the pattern paper, but this is the little three girls. And I, this film strip die here, I just ordered. I can order it now, and everybody else can't. Nobody else can get it until July, but those that had the RG Presents could order it yesterday. So I've ordered this little film strip die. But this stripe here is one of our pattern pieces of paper. So, you know, that's going to be fun to have. And then here, you can't see this very well, but there's the round, you know, the round film strip that's behind here. But you should see it adds a really nice little backdrop. And this here, this was actually on white cardstock, and we colored it by swiping our ink pads over it. And I'll show you how to do that one day. But this stamp set, this these cameras are just a it's a stamp set that they stamped onto white cardstock for us so that's a stamp and i ordered that because i love that um it's just a, a nice background and in here in the paper pack there's a colored camera page but this is just you can stamp it using any color ink you want but anyway there's that one um there's this one with the sunburst dyes and these little plastic flowers i guess they're pla they're probably some kind of resin but i think they are so cute we got a package of those in our kit this is the camera that i showed you in the with the small the ats size stamp this one and we just cut off see the stamp has the words on it but we took the sh I just we did we fussy cut it just around the camera and so this is what came out of that one and I just love these little flowers but this is part of our pattern paper this this here oh and if you see this this is a little clip we got a package whoops it's backwards this is a package of four clips and this was just one of them we got three other colors with three other little pictures on it but that one with the sunglasses on it just kind of went with that little girl and then this is the last one and this is the rectangular die the one that i showed you over top of a black and white sort of a starburst type print and i thought that turned out cute and these have little flowers on them that we we made so i just thought you'd like to see those and uh anyway let me finish telling you about my day so I got, I got excited about RG Presents, and during the RG Presents, he does a couple of giveaways. I think he gave away one stamp set, and then he gave away one die set. And they drew five names out of a hat for each one, and of course, I didn't win either one, which is usually me. I don't win anything. And lo and behold... At the very end of the broadcast, which my, it started at noon my time, and it was over at 6.30. So you can see we had Richard for a long time. It was so much fun. And, it, you know, at the very end, he did a drawing for a free registration for the next RG Presents, which registration starts on the 22nd of this month. And it's awesome because it is the holiday 
Uh, it's actually not going to be until July, but in August, our holiday mini catalog comes out, and the RG Presents is on holiday. Well, that's right up my alley. I love holidays. So they drew two names, and I was one of those names. So I get to go, I get to attend the next one for free. I am so excited. Of any of them that, I mean, I could probably make or break, you know, the others, but the holiday one I would have just died for. And my birthday is later this month, and I had planned on asking my kids if they wanted to chip in and pay for my $75 registration because, you know, I've got convention coming up and you know, my money is short and tight, and I thought, well, maybe that's something they could give me for a combination Mother's Day birthday present. And then I got free registration, so now they can get me something else. <laughs> anyway, uh, so then I, you know, finished up last night. I was all excited. I finally got myself calmed down, and I went to bed, got up this morning, and went to church. And when I got home, I had to check on my YouTube uh, messages because I'm doing a D-stash, which hopefully you all know about, and saw a message from Janice Whiting, who is another Fun Stampers Journey coach, and she is she has just made executive manager. There's only three people in the entire company that have earned the status of executive manager, and she just earned hers. And she uh, to celebrate, she was having a giveaway. So I just, I, you know, I made my comment like everybody else did, and I let her know I was a coach in case she didn't want to include coaches. And she came back and said, absolutely, and she's looking forward to meeting me at convention. But she said she was just so excited she was going to let everybody be eligible. Looked at that this morning, and I'm one of her eight winners. I mean, come on, folks. This I wish I played the lottery because this would have been the weekend for me to play. But I don't play the lottery. But I'm just, I've just been so excited. I just haven't been able to stand it. So I had to do this quick video. I am going to take a little bit of time to show you the, um, the Pro, uh, Project Me prints that are on the paper. Um, just let me move the camera down. And excuse my table. I'm doing this at my polymer clay table. And I haven't cleaned up from when I did my bracelet tutorial. My bad. But let me tilt this down. So you can see, can you see that okay? And hopefully you can see the whole, maybe not the whole page, but you can see most of it. But let me show you the Project Me prints. This is the stripe where I showed you that we had the stripe on our uh, one of the cards I used. And on the other side is, we use this print also. It's, it's just a bunch of little cameras on the cool pool background and I believe there's four of each yes there's four of each of these prints so that's awesome right there this is the one that has all the little sayings we you know selfie scenes uh, snap bang all the you know project uh, selfie face I got this all these cute little sayings and of course every once in a while there's a camera or there's a fist for a fist bump and on the other side is more striped paper. And this one is made to look more like a film strip with these sides here. And again, there's four of those. Here's that starburst. I love this because I usually cut my 12 by 12s into 6 by 6s And here's that starburst that we used on that card before with the white film strip. And there's also a stripe, there's this one, and there's that one. So that is awesome. I love black and white. Black and white stripes are great. And then there's these little things here if you want to use these. We used, um, which one did we use? I think we used this one in one of our projects. Which one did we use? No, we used this one. And let me find it. It's on, on this card. But you see, we cut the black ar from around it and just used that and just stamped on there, you're a sight for sore eyes, and used it as a background for the little girl. So there's all kinds of those here. 
on the back. So, like I said, there's four of each. I'm more excited about the black and white than anything because I love black and white. And this is our camera. You can see all the different cameras. And this one, you know, is awesome if you're a camera lover. And look at the back. This is a gradient. It's a Skinner blend, if you want to say that. But look at it, gradient from the bright green down to the duller green. And it's got all of those words on it, a little bit larger. So that's going to make an awesome background, too. So we have these. I'm just, I can't believe, I'm just so excited. And I don't get excited over paper, I'm sorry, but I am this one. This is gorgeous. These are just little, small film strips that are just arranged on here in random order, and they're adorable. And look at that, they look like flashes going off. That would make an awesome background, too. Look at this background here, just up here. That would make a gorgeous background on a card. So, is that it? No, there's one more. Now, this one was everybody's favorite. It's the Tone on Tone, the Little Tiny Hearts. And then on the other side, look at those girls. Are they not cute? Look at that. All the different skin tones and hair colors, and they are just adorable. So just imagine cutting one of those out and just putting it on a card with a stamp, and you've got yourself a, an adorable card. But I like this, too. We used this, I think we did, maybe not. Maybe that was on one of the ones Richard did. But anyway, let me tilt you back up so I can say goodbye. There we go. But that was my news I wanted to share, and I got to share a little bit about what's coming out in the next catalog. So if, if you're a camera person and you really like this stuff, it's coming out July 1. And this is just one of the collections. There's going to be three more. I can't wait to see those. So anyway, everyone, have a wonderful Sunday. Hope you went to church today. I did, and I thank God for all of my good fortune this weekend. And you are part of that good fortune. I love every one of you. So be blessed, and I will be back soon. Bye-bye.